Okay. Karibu. Naitwa YC kutoka Asma Shoe Store. Mimi nauza mtumba ndio biashara yangu. Mtumba wa viatu na nguo pia. Sasa hizi hapa siko navyo dukani lakini I do that too. That's my thing. By the way, this is my business na I can tell from basketball nimeweza kutengeneza hii platform yangu. Yeah, I create my own thing. Nimetengeneza kitu ambacho kinaendesha maisha yangu. This is the only thing that makes me survive in this life. And I'm thankful. Through game, imagine. That's why I love this game and I, I'm still surviving on this. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> so, I'm 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 feeling lucky kwa sababu basketball imenipa chance ya kupata namna ya kutengeneza hata kipato changu cha siku. Kimekuwa kitu kikubwa sana kwangu na nilijiona mwenye bahati siku moja nilishukuru Mungu nikasema na shukuru nilionyesha kikapu na ikawa nafasi. Mimi nacheza kikapu lakini sio pro game na nilitamani ningefika kiasi cha kucheza pro games na niwe ndani hadi lakini kuna muda ilifika nikajikuta basketball imenipa chance ya kufanya business zaidi kuliko nikiwa ndani ya mchezo. So nikachukua chance kama ilivyo. And now I'm here. Leo tuko Tanga. Tuna tuna solve Taifa Cup ya mwaka 2022. Tuko Tanga. So na Asma Shoe bado niko hapa na yasavu. Huu mzigo wote kuna mzigo mwingine mwingi zaidi mwingi zaidi mpaka atakapomaliza Taifa Cup tutaushusha hapo. So that's all. And I'm um, nataka bora zote kama mnaona hichi kitu muamini kwamba hivi tuna mnaona viko mezani vyote ni original hakuna fake kutoka smashu siuzi vitu fake so that's all karibuni sana karibuni wote karibuni sana by the way kwa kikapu kwa kiasi kikubwa kwa upande wangu imenipa chance kubwa sana na most of the impact is given to me kikapu kimenitengeneza lifestyle most kikapu kinanifanya kani strong muda wote mimi sifanyi mazoezi mengine zaidi ya kikapu i like i like basketball mimi na chochote ninachofanya basketball imenitengeneza disciplinary yani hata kinizamu naweza kurelate na societies nyingine kwa sababu napitia kwenye kikapu kuna maisha fulani watu wanaishi if you are not disciplined huwezi kukopi nao bro limit bigi hivi unajua kama una nizamu huwezi kusurvive kwenye maisha unajua kama hicho kwenye kwenye nyoso wa kikapu ndio wamesimamisha yani unaweza kucheza kikapu kama una nizamu basketball basketball the display for leo and i'm even thankful I'm creating my I mean I'm creating I'm creating myself gives me this little discipline I can copy some other people's na naweza ku ku maintain hata kwenye biashara kwa sababu kama behavior uwezi kusero uwezi kufanya mambo mengine yakawa yakasimama kwa yakiwa sahihi uwezi kufanya hata vitu vingine vikaenda this this I'm trying to say like basketball Touch me some things outside game outside life ni mbona lesson kubwa even sababu ukiacha ndani kutokana na watu wengine we come like families kila mtu ametoka na style yake the way unavyokopi na huyu na huyu na mwingine nakutana na tofauti sana through basketball so najifunza vitu vingi kutoka tofauti tofauti vitu tofauti tofauti and i can say much lakini nataka kila mtu ajue that I'm thankful through basketball nimetengeneza yani kwangu mimi nimetengeneza kitu kikubwa sana and I'm feeling this I'm really thankful yani nimeshukuru hata Mungu nimejikuta kwenye tasnia ya kikapu kwangu ni kitu kikubwa sana out of basketball uh, my business of, of on my business issues changamoto kubwa zaidi ni swala la upatikanaji wa stock kwa mfano mimi nauza vitu original so kuna wakati mtumbo waga unaadimika kabisa sokoni Yeah so inakuwa tough sana kupata stock nyingine ili kuwahudumia wateja wangu. So mimi kwangu ndio changamoto kubwa sana ina time. Kwa leo kwa leo come on. That's leo wanangu. That's leo. Why see? Why see? Za mtumba original. Yeah, na wanajua. That's it. That's it my nigga. That's it my nigga. For Leo, for Leo, for Leo, for Leo, for Leo, for Leo. The love for Leo, for Leo.